Okay. The truck is back where you would want to have a truck in a situation like this. Now all you gotta do is hit the master switch and everything's gonna happen at once. That is a lot of crap. Well, the belt goes back around and then we have to get in there and shovel it out. You're probably gonna hand me a shovel at some point, aren't you? Do you prefer square, square or, uh, or round? Okay, all right. Let me get in there and show you how it's done. All right. Notice how it blows back in when you put it on the belt. Really unavoidable. I think I get it, Steve. Be careful down here. You don't want to get end up outside in that truck. No, I don't. OK. Careful. Mike, it looks like you've done this once or twice. Once or twice. Try to get underneath the belt a little better, can you, Mike? You bet. Appreciate it. If you've ever asked yourself how much poo 160,000 chickens make in a day, the answer is about 26,000 pounds, with a 3% margin of error. It's good that it's dry. We water it down and heat it up and make it just right. This is something to look forward to. I'd like to hire you on, Mike. You're doing a good job. Thanks. Yeah, put right. you in touch with my agent. OK. I notice it's uh, moisture coming off the conveyor. There's a heaviness to it. I look for this. That's impressive. Those are one of the things I look for when I'm hiring somebody. Observational acuity. And there's a lot more that goes into ordering eggs, you know, over medium. This, this also is involved. You really take a holistic approach. If I see somebody leave a half a plate of eggs there, I almost want to go over and finish it, or at least have a discussion with them. I don't see anything weird about that at all. <laughs> oh, well.